Hey YouTube, Inquisitive Girl here once again with another video. Um, this time I'm going to show you how to add music from your from iTunes to your iPod. Um, this is the latest version of iTunes, so if I I'm a little slow, bear with me. I haven't gotten quite used to it yet so I'm going to add music the only way I know how well not the only way I know how but the one positive way I know how where I don't lose my music okay now I have my iPod connected it's right here just in case you were doubtful there is my iPod okay now um back to the library now to add music what you want to do is is here's the easiest way I've seen of how to do it is you get your folder I mean yeah you get your folder open for me, this is my um, hard drive. This is my uh, external hard drive right here. This is where we're at. Um, this is music that I have on there. I'm just going to take a little bit of it. There's a lot more than this, but I'm going to take a little bit of this to save time. Um, so what you do is you click on one and then hold down shift excuse the external noise that's my cat and you click on the the last one in the list and then you left click hold and drag over and it should add it to your library okay now it's in your library you can um you can make a playlist from this by um as i said give me a second i might be a little slow on this new playlist you title it this is all disco music yeah I know I'm old school okay and then you select one shift select the last one move it over and you're done I mean not done done but you have a playlist now you select playlists and you should see your one playlist right there I have I have more than one but the other one is empty because I emptied out my library the other two are empty I should say anyway now what you want to do is um hang on a second what you want to do over here on the right where it says add to you click that wait I think I messed up sorry about that hit done add to wait um I have done this before and I can't remember how I did it but oh okay as I said I'm not used to this version so give me a give me a few minutes to play around um, selected playlists artists albums and genres 
uh, I want this playlist and I think that's it and you hit apply and it should sync your playlist to your iPod see you see that uh, rotating double arrow now if I was to go back to my iPod on this iPod there you go this is the music on my iPod now I've heard people say that too much of anything is yeah those of you <laughs> those of you that are old school would know that that's 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 awesome music right there um anyway <laughs> If you like this, um, give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe, comment, whatever you want to do. But um, as I said before, I am not used to this particular version of iTunes. So I hope you don't comment on my lack of um, knowledge about the app. Um, I believe that's it. Now... You have your playlist, you've added it to your iPod, all you have to do is um, you click this button right here to eject it from your computer and on your music you should have, actually I already do, <laughs> while your, com your, your computer is connected to your iPod you can actually click on your music um, button on your iPod and you should see when you click on the playlist tab you should see the playlist right on your device um, I don't think it will play because it's connected to the computer but let's see it's playing Okay, it's playing externally on the iPod, um, and you can play it from the computer also while the iPod is still connected. This is the song I was just playing. Alright, well... Thank you for watching my video and uh, comment, rate, subscribe and I will see you next time.